Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev, and we are back with more of the Outer Worlds. Peril on Gorgon. And we last left off, we had just gotten here, unlocked it. If you're curious how we got to this point, hey, there's a playlist. Jump back, look at the various videos. Let's get some. We are in the transition to synthesis and manufacturing center. Pam. Hi, Pam. Welcome to the Adrena Time Synthesis and Manufacturing Center, brought to you by Spacer's Choice. This productivity auto mechanical unit is at your disposal. Its normal duties involve the management of legacy operations analytics. However, due to the promotion, demotion, death, or injury to other managers of this facility, this unit is now the acting manager of the following departments. Reception. Human Resources, Accounting, Technical Support, Manufacturing, Distribution, Security. Please direct any questions about those departments to Pam. Answers not guaranteed. According to this facility's hierarchy, there are zero acting managers at this Spacer's Choice facility. Not to worry. If a middle manager cannot immediately be replaced, Pam can safely oversee 3.176 departments. When you're in a productivity pinch, Pam can pick up the pieces. Uh-oh. <laughs> it looks like there are intruders in this facility. Protocol recommends speaking to the head of facility security right away. Did you know that keeping your workers alive boosts productivity? That's why every PAM unit comes equipped with the latest Spacer's Choice weaponry. When PAM's emergency combat protocols are activated, your investments are sure to be protected. Warning! Due to power consumption, combat protocols cannot be activated when PAM's power is below 73% without deactivating managerial processes. Spacer's Choice policy dictates that managerial processes take priority. This unit's power rating is... 57%. Hmm. Hate messing with tangled cables or confusing batteries? With Pam, you'll never have to. Just pop in a Firefly brand industrial strength battery, and Pam's ready to go. Out of batteries and need productivity now? No problem. Just hook Pam's power source up to another auto mechanical, and Pam will get your employees back in line in no time. Pam is fully customizable to fit your preferred management style. With the correct override codes, you can alter any of Pam's behaviors at will. Some limitations apply. Spacer's Choice does not accept legal responsibility for any injuries or trauma sustained after altering Pam's behaviors. See manual for details. Emergency combat protocols cannot be engaged at less than 73% power without proper authorization. Please ensure that this unit is fully charged, or present your override password. I could give it a shot. Let me just... Huh. Okay. Weird way to do that, but there ain't no accounting for sense. <laughs> there we go. All I had to do was convince this old girl here that 73% was the new 100%. Easy as salt tuna and sawdust pie. Ew. This unit's power rating is 100%. Great! Emergency combat protocols are now available. Error. Employee's biometric ID does not match this unit's designated manager. Proceeding with verbal management test. Pretend that this PAM unit is one of your employees who has been working long hours. What would you say to give them an extra pep pill in their step? Well, how can I be the biggest douchebag possible? Let's see. Um, so most managerials, it's always the carrot and then the stick. Let's lie. Pam is equipped to talk about your career goals. 
On average, employees managed by PAM units go from assistant to associate roles in 15 years or less. Jeez. My door is always open, unless I'm recharging. Verbal management test complete. Result. Employee is a spacer's choice manager. 94% certainty. Of Engaging course. Engaging emergency combat protocols. Stand by. So now Pam's on our side. All right. I think that was probably a good idea. Where are you going, Pam? Oh, I'm glad he's not alive. What's on the other side if there's another door? Are those eyes following us? What Who eyes would where? Build such a creepy thing. If I didn't know better, I'd swear it was watching me. What's watch? Oh. Yeah, it's turning. Show your boss that you are prime because you take a tree at a time. Maybe just a slow twist, man. There's like uh, enemies everywhere. I wonder if you'd get the uh, Mach 3 weapons if you hadn't gotten the Mach like 1 versions yet. You know what I mean? If you only on only have, but you haven't gotten like Mach 3, right? What is this? Oh, Pam, you energy stuff. There's another way to fix her. Okay. Is she fighting someone? Oh, those look like bombs. Oh well. Hard right, yeah. One sec. Alright, got ammo, everything else. Alright, so we're going in this direction, looks like. Well, once we figure out a way, ooh. Ooh. I see people running and fighting over there. We want to get in on that. the whole area for me so I'll just come around here and unlock a few things girls kill everybody for me I don't have to do too much work hey what's up Pam Pam's off to get some. Looks like whatever was here, she already lit all these guys. Oh, wow. She's like clearing everything out for us. Jeez.
What's this? Great work. Uh oh. What the hell's all that? She must be lighting them up up there. I don't know if I'm impressed or suspicious. I'm building something here, and it probably ain't good. Does Pam survive? This, this door suddenly closed. Oh, you got that? Yeah, I got it, girl. What do we got here? useless. Oh, Pam died. Poor Pam. Oh, well. We'll just have to fight on in her name. You could go in in any way. Oh, here we go. Now to another weirdo. Now we're going back up. Okay. Slowly. What is it with the board and giant machines? There's something mystical about this thing. Almost. Holy. Is that weird? Yeah, I have to say that sounds kind of weird to me. How do you get up there? All right. Now we can finally get that journal and get the heck out of here. What are I feeling it's not gonna be that easy? Gosh, that's clever. Looks like there's another way you could go about getting in here.
Okay. Great work. Oh. Ooh, I wonder if that watercolor painting is going to be like we can There's give that to our daughter. The corner. Bet that's a way out. Yep. And we're stalking. And we're stalking. Okay. I know there's supposed to be more DLC coming out for it next year. I know that. We'll probably play it again. Yeah, active quest. We're supposed to go back to our ship. So that's where we'll go. We are receiving an incoming signal, Captain. Uh oh. Captain, I see you've made some headway on Gorgon. Mother's old work terminal just lit up with a bunch of new protocols. Very exciting. What about Mother's journal? Any progress there? Are you accusing me of deception? Captain, I would never. Can you hear me, Captain? I'm getting some interference mm. on my end. Captain. Captain! Hello again, little weasel. I must admit, you've surprised me. Oh, it's your mom. I threw nearly everything <coughs> I had at you. And you overcame it all. Mm-hmm. Well spotted, Captain. We've both played our roles well. But it seems you've got the edge. I may have gravely underestimated you. Maybe. You were smart to hire him, Wilhelmina. Well done. Mother! You're alive! And it's still on Gorgon? I thought she was. Who ever thought a lone scientist could survive for five years on Gorgon? This is so you, Mother. Inserting yourself where you aren't needed and at the worst possible time. Am I disrupting your vanity project, you empty-headed little twit? Olivia Ambrose doesn't do happy. Have you come back just to ruin everything again, Mother? At least this time, I have the power to stop you. Captain, this is a distraction. Let's set our differences aside and focus on what matters. Adrena time must never be revived. Hmm. Let's see. Um... Yeah. I thought you were a part of Minnie's ploy. Her ally in this mad, selfish scheme to resurrect Adrena time. Oh, no, yeah, we're not gonna let that happen. But now that I understand she was lying to you, I find I want your help. I'm sorry for trying to kill you, Captain. <laughs> I just thought I'd try. I should have been honest with you from the start. Oh, uh, shoulda, woulda, coulda. You've shown yourself more than capable of handling all that Gorgon and I could throw at you. You might be the only one with the metal to put Gorgon down for good. Hmm. Adrena Time didn't create marauders, mismanagement did. Uh. By now you realize that Project Gorgon was devoted to a single drug, Adrena Time. A drug that hit the market in spite of calamitous side effects. The project was a colossal failure. 
But you and I are going to revive it from the ashes. No, we're not. Um. Yeah, how? How, how are we supposed to do this? Mother's journal contains the activation codes for the Adrena Time Synthesizer. The key to a new Project Gorgon. We're going to start again. And this time with everything Project Gorgon didn't have. Better R&D, better scientists, clear goals, more funding, and a timeline that makes sense. You have every reason to doubt me. But if you have a shred of hope for a better colony, consider what Adrena Time could do for us. If I can improve the chemistry, I can fix Adrena Time. We can put this colony back on track together. Yeah, Mama-san couldn't do it. What makes you think you can? I learned from her mistakes, and I have no intention of repeating them. Listen to yourself. Adrena Time ruined lives. It killed people, changed them. And now Halcyon buckles beneath the yoke of my failure. We can't risk opening Pandora's box a second time. I agree. What about my life, Mother? Ugh. The Ambrose name has no dignity anymore. I can't even show my face around Byzantium without being the gossip of the town. Wah. Yeah, there we go. It's no laughing matter, Captain. What good can I do if I have no influence? How can I fix society if I can't even take out a loan? Every day, workers slump over from exhaustion. The gears of industry swallow them whole, and no one is coming to help. Adrena time is the break we can't fit into the schedule. The office with a window we can't afford to build. It's the best this rotten colony can do for people. Yeah, no. Don't let those bloodless leeches at Spacer's Choice walk you down this perilous path, Wilhelmina. You haven't the fortitude to endure it. As usual, Mother projects her failures onto me. If she had let me get involved from the start, we might have avoided this calamity altogether. Minnie doesn't have the mind or the backbone to do the truly difficult work of genius. She is an empty-headed social climber. Nothing more. You see what I mean? Mother is afraid of being outdone by her empty-headed daughter. And she'll do anything to stop me. That's not what I'm saying. If I can save the colony and redeem the Ambrose family name, I owe it to myself to try. Mother be damned. All right, I think I'm going to say only... Yeah. Social engineering takes generations, and we don't have the luxury of time. We need to mainline progress into Halcyon's bloodstream. You've seen more of this colony than the average grunt. You know as well as I do that this is a question of survival. Actually, all I've seen is the corporations destroying the, uh, the regular guy. So kind of like here in the United States, the 2% has no problem destroying the rest of us. So, yeah, I'm done. I need that facility online, but I can't do it while Mother's still a problem. By now, she'll have shut down the Gorgon reactor. Deal with her however it suits you, and get that facility back up and running. Don't do this, Wilhelmina. Minnie, don't make this choice. Adrena time is our future. It's bigger than money, bigger than family. It's the colony's best hope. Return to my family's manor, Captain. Use the executive override code in my journal to activate the NDA protocol for my terminal. Okay. It will destroy the Gorgon drug synthesizer and put an end to Adrena time for good. That's what we're gonna do. My daughter's gotten her hooks into you. I understand. She's always had a knack for manipulating Yeah, it's not gonna stop me, though. But I know you're more than her foolish little puppet. You've survived this long. You have to be more. She will try to force you to fight her. You don't have to. In fact, 
I would ask you not to. Whatever mistake she might make, she... She is still my daughter. Captain, in light of recent events, I'm putting the manor under lockdown. Until Mother is dealt with, anyone who lands here is presumed hostile. Oh. Finish the job. I know you won't disappoint me. There we go. Wink. <laughs> Make a finger at the screen. Get ready to surprise, ladies. <laughs> Alrighty, folks. And on that funny-ass note, we will end right there. We will come back. And probably finish this bad boy. Because, yeah, either you can go there, I would assume, right? Yeah. So you can go to Ambrose Manor. Or you can stay here and go work your way through down into that. So, tune in next time, and I'll tell you what we're probably going to do, because I might change my mind. I don't know. Give your heads down, your guns up, and I'll see you again real damn soon.